goodness. Was Faerun always so... dull? Still, at least the company was worth a trip, if not the view. Not to be overly pedantic, but they are my powers now. I imagine you're wondering how all this came to be. The finer points of divine ascension are beyond mortal comprehension, I'm afraid, but I can provide a rudimentary sequence of events. First, I retrieved the crown of Carsus and reforged it using a series of precise and highly complex Netherese incantations. Then, I used it. As you know, the orb within me was the half-formed Carsite Weaver. Magic left incomplete by Carsus's self-destruction. I finished it. Using the crown of Carsus, I turned it into a new form of magic, fused with my being, driven by my purpose. And then I put it to work. As expected, Mistra was unwilling to hand over the reins of the weave, so... I've claimed dominion over another area which I've... passing familiarity. Ambition. <laughs> mm, I don't recall saying that I've given up. I can say this much for now. Mistra is welcome to her dominion. My aims are set a little higher than offering cursory blessings to just any half-decent spellcaster. I exist not to bestow favors on my followers, but to inspire them, to seize their destinies for themselves, exactly as I did. I'm their proof. Proof their hopes are not barren wastes, but the loamy soil in which their future achievements will flourish. Proof that with ambition, anything is possible. Ao would prefer to let the cosmic dust settle from my unexpected ascension before considering my right to grant my followers such power. I'm sure it'll come around in a millennium or so. And by then, my creed will be something to reckon with. There are already several shrines in my honor scattered across the outer reaches of Thay, and rumors of a very prominent temple under construction in Arm. This is only the beginning. I thought you would be. Now, divine as my company undoubtedly is, I have an eternity to catch up with you. A luxury few others at this party possess. Don't let me deprive them of your company. Or mine, for that matter. It's not every day a newborn god shows up to the reunion. It's quite something, isn't it? To be in the presence of the Divine. Fear not. That tingling sensation is merely your body's way of alerting you to my presence. It's perfectly harmless. In small doses. <laughs> 